Hey everybody, welcome to Station C, Diffraction and Wavelength. The directions here is that your objective at the station is to diffract white light and report the results by looking through a spectroscope while it's pointed towards a white light source. There's four questions. One is, how does the light look inside the spectroscope? Two, why did the light change as it entered the spectroscope? Three, you're going to actually draw the, uh, the visual of the light being broken up. And then four, what color of light has the biggest wavelength? So here's your spectroscope. Uh, if, if and when you can get your hands on one of these, you're going to look through this smaller end and aim this side at your light source. When you're looking inside here, there's a little slit like this and a big window like this. This little slit is what you're going to aim at the light, and then this is what will show up in terms of light being broken up by color. All right, so I'm going to try and give you a visual of what it looks like when you hold it to a white light. So there you go, I'm holding it to uh, your, your standard classroom ceiling light. And you can see kind of on the right, there's the number four, five, six, and seven. And those are the colors that are making up this bulb. Now, kind of on a cooler side, um, I've got this pinwheel of color. We've got blue, green, and red. Red and blue are primary, where green is secondary. But I'm going to hold this over. Um, so I'm going to aim it at the green light for you. And you can see what colors make up this light bulb. And then if I shift it down to the red, what shows up here, and then if I move over to the blue, you can see kind of a shift um, in that lens. I do want to point out though on that, uh, on the right side, that red part that's just the red light bulb showing up through. So you really need to look underneath the four, five, and six uh, to see what the light's made up of. All right, good luck completing the rest of this page.